Hey guys, welcome back to this SQL tutorial course. In this session, we will work with the except operator. So the except operator combines two select statements and returns unique records from the left query which are not part of the right query. For example, if the first select statement returns these four fish and the second select statement returns these three fish, then the except operator would return us these two fish which were part of the first select statement but not the second select statement. And this is the syntax of the except operator. We'll give the first select statement. After that, we'll give the except operator. Following which, we'll give the second select statement. Now, you also need to keep in mind that the number and order of columns must be same in both the select queries. And we'll be implementing the except operator on these two tables. So we have the student details one table, which has the columns SID, S name, and S marks, and has these four records. And the other table is student details two, which has the same columns and comprises of these three records. So let's go to SQL Server and work with the except operator. Right, so we have our two tables right in front of us. So let me type in the syntax. I will give the first select query, which is select star from, and then I'll give in the name of the table, which is student details one. After that, I will use the except operator and then give in the second select statement. Select star from the name of the table as student details two. I'll select all of this again. I'll hit execute. So this is the result of the except operator. So these are the two records which were part of the first select statement, but not the second select statement. And this is how we can work with the except operator. Thanks for attending this session. Let's meet in the next class.